What's up? My name is Technoba, here for Troubleshoot, and basically, I missed out on the first Netflix party rush. I was interested in doing a video, but never did. Since then, Netflix Party has rebranded to Teleparty. They now support multiple platforms, but they all work the same as Netflix, so I'll be showing you that in today's video. I'll be showing you how to use Netflix Party, which is now Teleparty. To use Teleparty, you'll need Google Chrome or a Chromium-like browser, such as the new Microsoft Edge or Brave. I'll use Google Chrome as a simple example. To install Teleparty, either head across to the Netflix Party webpage and then click Install Teleparty. This will take you to the Chrome Web Store for Teleparty. You can, of course, click the Chrome Store link in the description down below as well to get here. Then you can click Add to Chrome and Add Extension. This will install the Teleparty extension in your browser. In the top right, you should notice a TP icon for Teleparty. If you click somewhere else and the icon vanishes, simply click the puzzle piece, then simply locate Netflix Party is now Teleparty or simply Teleparty and click the pin icon next to it. This will bring the icon back to the top over here. Now to start watching a show or movie with your friends, simply head across to Netflix, Disney+, HBO, or Hulu. I'll be heading across to Netflix for this example. Simply locate either a show or a movie you'd like to watch with friends. Then click on it to open it up. Once the movie or show opens up, simply pause the video, then click the Teleparty button in the top right of Chrome. Then before we start the party, we have the option so only I can control pausing, playing, and changing the time of the video. Leaving this option unchecked allows anyone in the room to control the video for everyone else, including themselves. Usually it's a good idea to leave this unchecked if you'd like to watch the movie synced with everyone else, allowing everyone to pause and play. Then when you're ready, simply click Start the Party. Note that only one person has to do this. From here, simply click the Copy URL button and you'll have a link that you can send to your friends. Note that others joining will need Google Chrome or a Chromium browser and the Teleparty extension installed as well. Clicking on the link opens the same movie or episode as you and after a while it should open the chat window. If it doesn't appear for others, simply click the Teleparty button and after a couple of seconds you should be connected to the party. From here, you can send messages to each other in real time and by clicking the link button at the top, you're able to copy the share link so you can give it to other friends to join the party as well. Then right next to this icon, we have a profile picture icon which you can click, then click your profile picture and choose a different one if you'd like. On top of this, you'll be able to add a nickname so that you'll be able to tell who is who in the party. After entering one and clicking save changes, every message that you send will have your username attached to it. This is saved between parties. From here, simply pausing, playing, reversing and fast forwarding the movie will happen for everyone else as well. When a video ends, it should automatically go across to the next episode or of course you can click the next episode button at the bottom over here. Then everyone else will be taken across to the next episode and everyone will carry on watching as you'd expect. Note that you're not able to skip through multiple episodes or change the series entirely. After skipping a couple of episodes, you'll see this notification over here. Simply clicking Return to Party takes you back to the previous video you were on. If you were the host, you'll see this over here. All that you have to do to fix that is simply create a new party as we did before. Then go ahead and share this new link with your friends. Another side note, if someone clicks on an old link from an older episode of the season, they won't be entered into the same party. You'll have to send them a new link for each new episode of the show that you're watching if they're not already in the party when it progresses to the next episode. All the links will only be active while you're watching that episode. If you'd like to leave the party and continue watching on your own, you can click the Teleparty button and then the Disconnect button to leave the party entirely. This will stop syncing your video with others so that you can watch it entirely on your own. But usually you don't want to do this. Instead, you might want to click the show chat checkbox to hide the chat window and watch the movie in full screen without the sidebar. Then pausing playing, reversing and fast forwarding will work synced with your friends as well. To show the chat again, simply just open it up and click show chat. Everything that I showed you in this video applies for other platforms, including Disney+, HBO, and Hulu. As new platforms are added to Teleparty, they should work very similarly on those as well. But anyways, that's about it for this video. Hopefully you found something useful in it. My name's been Technoba here for Troubleshoot, and I'll see you all next time. Ciao!